everyone, and welcome back to Scourge Way. <laughs> we are. Uh, we just murdered our wife. <laughs> and uh, now we're we're just trying to make our escape through this really grungy house. Actually, we're supposed to go up to the attic because a phone person on the phone recommended it. Okay. And oh, and we're back where we used to be. Yep. Back and then the, to get to the attic. The house proper. Uh, bad reflections. Uh, I think we we need to go up there, but we need a fuse, if you remember. Yes. I like that, like the time of day. It's like gotten darker. I just love a like a time of day changing in a video game. Oh yeah, dude. I'm all about that. Context. Yeah, there's that fuse. Context. It's one of my pet peeves in gaming is that uh Oh whoa. hey Mia, how are you? Oh, there she is. Okay. Glad oh, she's okay. She's good. Glad she's okay. Whoa, she's done. Oh. Um my pet peeves in uh, video games is that one area will be one time of day and then you just go to another area and it's another time of day just constantly in that place. Yeah, and it will just change back and forth. Yeah, that's frustrating. Okay. Is I that think, all it took? Yeah, I think now we just go up, press the button. Oh, okay. hey Mia. I did miss you. I like that you can see the shadow with... Oh, uh, I thought she had a knife behind her back. Yep. Uh, Mia. You know, this whole routine is getting really old. Man, poor Ethan gets a lot that happens to his hands. Yeah. Well, good thing he has the hydrogen peroxide. Yeah. That will fix oh. any problem. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You know, where'd you? This yeah. Okay. <laughs> Can we talk through this? This doesn't happen. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, that'll happen. Oh. That's only happened to me once. Ooh. I've been married for nearly Man. ten years, only once. So yeah, I kept myself lucky. That is uh, rough. Oh, dude. Oh, so sir, how did you lose your hand? Well, it's a long story. <laughs> I like how he keeps holding it up. Hey, have a hand. Um, this could have been a very cool Evil Dead moment where you make yourself a... Uh, Chainsaw arm. Oh, dude. The, the, somebody on the design team wanted that to be the case. Oh. <laughs> okay, ready to regrow your hand. <laughs> Ooh. Mmm. <laughs> I can still feel it. The pain in my fingers. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Big budget Japanese games this generation where you lose an, a limb. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, like a lot. Like I know. Sekiro, Metal Gear Solid 5, Resident Evil 7. Um, I, I mean, I just like, I know I've made this point before, but I always just wish that, uh, like, they went more like these games where you lose a limb like actually made that more impactful by and permanent you, yeah like permanent or oh there hey, was a gun hey, on how the you table doing? i see that now no like totally uh a like, good example of that happening is i think snake eater well but like even uh, okay so like it's a little eater, bit. you lose your eye and then when you go to aim in first person like half the screen is darkened out well, I like that in um, Snake Eater 3D on the 3DS, the 3D is turned off when you're looking at first person after you lose your eye. Yeah, that's pretty sick. But, I mean, like, that's just, like, a really small thing, which is nice. A small thing could go a long way. But I really think it would, like, the Phantom Pain, Metal Gear Solid 5, the Phantom Pain, would have, it could have meant a lot more. Because, like, you lose an, a limb, that's a serious loss. But, in, like, mechanically... In a lot of these games, it actually becomes a feature, and it becomes like, "Wow, this is actually a lot better." And yeah, I'll say, maybe I should cut off all of them all because of I my get limbs. some sick robot arm that yeah is can better. do all these features and shoot rockets out of it and stuff. Yeah, 
I mean, I, I guess there's a character in the Phantom Pain who does who chooses not to get prosthetic, like proper, like robo prosthetics, you know, and is super bitter about it. Mm-hmm. I think there's stuff in these, but can't you just like melee the? I don't think so. You can't melee with a wep- uh with a firearm. No, oh, I shoot. don't know. Hmm. Never mind. I think we can do a double shot here. Boo. Yay. There was nothing. <laughs> Other than being cool. You you can see it, but his ears are bleeding from <laughs> the fire, firing of the weapon in that tiny, tiny room. Uh-oh. Oh. Hey, Mia. How are you? Ow. You that, know, that was just rude. Ow. It's up to me. <laughs> uh, wow. you know, she has the right head bobbed <laughs> bullets. It's like Vash the Stampede. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Man, I'm I'm just really glad that I'm this good at video games. <laughs> Jacob sucks at video games. <laughs> Come on, reload, man. I know you I know you're missing an arm, but like Oh. <sighs> Confirm the kill. <laughs> Double tap. Can I take the chainsaw or No. <sighs> Can I break the chainsaw? <laughs> okay. Um, it has been so long ago, I don't remember what we're supposed to do here. Uh, oh. Hey, welcome to Vanison. <laughs> Thank you. What a warm welcome. Iconic line. <laughs> yep. Father-in-law. <laughs> Son-in-law. Takes, takes me back. Ooh. It, there's a very similar scene in um, The Witcher Blood and Stone. Uh, no, Heart and Stone. Oh, no, I'm thinking of um, Blood and Wine. Uh, uh, yeah, I got Heart mi- Stone and Heart, Blood hearts and Wine. Of St- hearts of Stone. Hearts of Stone and Blood and Wine. Yeah, I'm thinking of Hearts, and, uh, uh, hearts of Stone. Oh, yeah, just a stable gun that back on there. Thank you. Oh, and they they got you a... Um, Apple Watch. Yeah. So we can check uh, how many steps we got in today. Make sure we're at our peak fitness. What am I thinking of? The, uh, the ones that are just Fitbit? about fitness. Fitbit, yeah. Thank you. Fitbit. You got your arm cut off, but, you know, you got a Fitbit. Yeah, I mean, really, I don't understand why doctors don't do that more often with, like, missing limbs. Just staple gun it back on and wrap a Fitbit around it. Oh, my God, it's Wade. <laughs> no one will understand that, but... Hey. Yes. <laughs> that guy on the left, you don't know him, but that's our Uncle Wade. <laughs> hey! That's, oh. Uh, yeah. Hey, that's that old lady, right, from the picture. Whoa! Hey, buddy. This seems a little bit outrageous, but it's one of my favorite things in um, in stories. No, I really don't want to, sir. Sir, I'm, yeah. I ate lunch I earlier. I'm no, not I really don't. hungry. Uh, oh. Yeah, don't eat the tripe. Yeah. Ooh. Um, but it is like one of my favorite things in video games of... Like the it meeting the whole pantheon of villains, like this is like the bosses you will be fighting later on in the game. Uh, Metal Gear style. Yeah. Okay, just put the knife down. I this isn't fun anymore. That's I enough. Why, I forget sir. why is it, why is he stabbing us? I don't know. We didn't eat it. It was rude. The guy with the knife has my hairline. (laughs) 
So how uh, you doing? You come here often or? That is a mannequin made out of jerky. <laughs> oh. Hmm, are we not going to comment on that our hand is back? This is a neat room. Kind of like, what, like a oh, den? Conan O'Brien had wrote that thing. Did you see that? Was it, pardon? Oh, yeah. Clive, uh, Conan's brother, Clive. Mm -hmm. His twin brother, Clive. Clive and Conan. They were inseparable when they were children. Cool entertainment stand that is missing a proper television. Oh, grandfather clock. Right uh, behind you. Do you think there's an elixir behind it? Oh, maybe. Do you not understand that reference? From Final Fantasy VI. Yeah. Come on, okay. man. Well, you didn't understand it when I brought it up in Silent Hill 2, so... Oh, no, like, because it's so obvious. Well, you didn't comment on it, so... How, how do you think that makes me feel? Anybody who's... You know, it's a huge anybody waste who's of energy to leave the fridge open. Anybody who... Oof. Mm. <clears throat> oh, that was Ooh. so good. So good. Mm. I should, they should be thanking me. I just saved them a lot on their electrical bill. Female 50s meaty saute. Man, like, okay, even for, like, if this wasn't, like, effed up because this is, like, people that they're eating, like, how often are you writing on a post-it note on your fridge what you ate on a particular day? Like, that's the, really the weird part. Well, I mean, I think, you know, maybe as just to keep track of things before they go bad. It's like, oh, I put the souffle in the uh, the fridge at this date. But I don't think they're really that concerned about things going bad, are they? <laughs> <laughs> oh, a mattress. Pull it out when you have company. Skillverware. Huh. It's locked. Just kick I, it open, buddy. There's a giant hole in it. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, a lot of trash. They probably, this is the recycling. Very environment, uh, environmental conscious. I like their enamel fridge. Yeah? Yeah, dude. I'm all about that. I don't know. I bet it stinks. No, I mean the, just the aesthetics. Hmm. You know, you know, everybody's gaga over stainless steel. And I was like, I, I think it looks all right. But I think just enamel appliances look very cool. Hey. Let's, just, hey. Uh, let's just go the other way. Right hey there, now. fella. Uh, <laughs> We're just going to be over here. I mean, thanks for being so nice to me and all. But um, I wonder if the garage is this way. Probably not. I need a knife. It's not a knife. Knife? Where's my knife? Oh, um, maybe in the kitchen? No, I think the cops got to give you the knife. Uh, no, the cop, you, you get into the garage and then that's where you meet the cop. Spoilers. No, he comes to the door first. Oh, no, grandma's gone. Where did you go? There's a question mark? What it? Some sort of something? Um, hmm. Oh! Hey, buddy. Hey, uh... Sorry, I didn't mean anything by it. Oh, hey, hey, hey. hey buddy. Was that a shovel that you got? A shovel knight. <laughs> oh, that was a huge surprise in, um, I was playing Bloodstained, finally. Uh, that their sh shovel knight is an enemy in Bloodstained. <laughs> yeah. That was neat. Ow. Or they call it shovel armor instead of axe armor, which is cute, I think. Instead of just like a, a straight, it's an, it's, an, it's a like subtle nod, you know, not it's just pretty, a, yeah, I mean, not just like a straight cameo, like in ukulele or something. Mm -hmm. Open the hatch. Go ahead. Hashtag open the hatch. Go ahead. Open the hatch. Go ahead. Hop down. Thank you. Damn it, I can't follow <laughs> you into this gross filth that's under there. <laughs> it's kind of a weird uh, texture 
issue. Yeah, it's pretty low res looking. It's like the microwave in uh, Uncharted 2. Oh, there oh, it goes. There. Oh, there. You know, can I just, I think I, if, if, if it were me, i just stay right here. Like, i just wait the rest of the night out. Um, you know, at some point he'd probably just come down and get you. <laughs> he'd be like, oh, I don't know. No, he'd just keep pacing. Oh, I don't know. Where do you go? Um, people hate this kind of stuff. Like, for some reason, in, um, like Naughty Dog games, like they'll have like environmental design with the color leading your way. Like, I mean, this is kind of a very subtle thing, I guess. And maybe it was even by accident, but it sort of seems no, like... No, I'm sure not. You know, okay, so you have the light guiding you down and then this orange cable to yeah, pull you up. No, I'm, I'm all about that kind of... People, like, make fun of it, but hey, like, it's way smarter than, um, like, a lot of games, like the Tomb Raider reboot that just... Or maybe that's a bad example. I don't well, remember. Well, like, big shining ledges yeah, and like shit. Yeah, like, Enslaved, it's like... Go here, flashing ledge. They really stink. Yeah. Just the socks. Oh, stinky feet. <laughs> the whole fucking that the I mean, I don't know if that's that this guy's being like extra picky or those socks stink more than the rest of this fucking house with its <laughs> gross rotting meat and like wet damp fucking uh black mold. <laughs> <laughs> You know, just no, yeah. This this guy's really got a problem with stinky feet. It's kind of weird to me, like how, like people have like such a problem, like I like such a problem with different like functions of like being a human, like being like like people are like, oh, gross, sweat, or like, oh, gross, like snot, and it's like I get like some of that's ingrained in like just our like mentality because it's like oh snot like if there's snot I could get sick from that or like sweat it's like oh it smells like BO but like there is elements there but it's also like a very human thing that we all do and like I wish that we didn't have to be all so What's self conscious the- oh it stinky sucks right gotcha. I wish that we didn't all have to be so self conscious about like oh I'm you know I'm really self conscious with my feet stinking or oh like you know I like burps or something like you know what i mean like i just wish that we could live in a society that wasn't so bent out of shape about like jake is trying to make a case about how much he smells right now yeah i'm like right next to him it's 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 pretty it's pretty ripe i know (laughs) it is do we go back down you you just done a 10 mile hike can you can you i thought you unlocked that door directly behind you behind whoa i think that's a collectible it's a bobblehead Right there, the door. it's locked. You, oh. it said you unlocked it. When? When you walked against it. Damn it, it said Joe. It, uh, did you unlock that door while I wasn't looking, just to make me a fool out of me? Hey, it's, it's Lisa hanging out there in the corner. There. <laughs> That's her dress. Yeah. She just wore a curtain. <laughs> kind of. He did. Scratch it out. Cross it out. This is a very Resident Evil door. <laughs> yeah. I, you know, I can think of so many houses where there are vaults. Hey, it's me. Sort of. Kind of. They seem nice. Hey, another bobblehead. I'm just a collectible master. Except I don't have anything to break them, so. Do you Do we have anything to interact with that door with? No. Gotcha. What do I look like? Uh, Mr. Gadget? Inspector Gadget? <laughs> Please. <laughs> Inspector Gadget is my father. <laughs> Call me Mr. Gadget. <laughs> um, okay, not that way. I got something, right? That I thought I got something that then, now I could... Man, that is just a mess. Okay, I still don't have a knife. What the F? What the fuck? Oh my G. 
Is this house party from Game Grumps? Uh-huh. <laughs> hey, how's what it going, f- dude? How's it going, dude? I'm straight edge. <laughs> um, if anybody hasn't seen that, please watch watch Game Grumps play House Party. I love that game. I feel stupid. I mean, mostly, I think if we were in it, you know, you just had your headphones in and you were, you would know exactly where to go. I think it's just because we're shooting the shit and we can barely hear anything. <laughs> I like when his hand goes up, it's like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we can go back down here. No. Is there seriously not a knife in the in the? I I really feel like the cop gives you a knife. Dude, I. Mm. He gives you like a knife through the front door or something. Oh. Hmm. Something about that does. F- f- there's something vaguely familiar about what you just said. Actually, I don't know. I think the front door is later. Hmm. And surprisingly big house. I just wonder if I like missed it down here. No. You know what I mean? <laughs> let's see. There's a m- Okay, let's There's a marker still on your map, right? Yeah. But I think that's just like a thing to interact with, like a locked drawer. Hmm. There are a lot hmm. of like weird locked drawers. Why aren't there more of that? Maybe I need to try this. Yeah, no. Um. Okay. I'd say check that symbol again. Yeah, I mean, I was just at it. I know. Where did I even, like, come out here again from? Oh, the laundry room. Yeah, there's something about that area next to the dining room. Or dining area. Okay, we'll go check it out again. I mean, at least it's, like, feels safe. (laughs) It's just this. What is it? Oh, it wants a key. Okay, got it. What did I think it was? I can't remember what I kept saying it was. (laughs) Check the tape. (laughs) Uh, Just grab a blade out of the blender. Oh my gosh. Where do I go? Oh, someone had to wipe with a paper towel. That's brutal. And then hang it up. But it's the socks that smell the worst. <laughs> yeah. Well, we'll figure it out in between episodes or never. <laughs> Whichever happens first. <laughs> yeah. See you then, everybody. Bye. Bye.